Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Christian. Today I'm gonna to be talking about fulfillment by Amazon and where you can find products that you can sell on Amazon. If you're not familiar with fulfillment by Amazon, it's basically a process where third-party sellers send their products into Amazon's fulfillment warehouses where then Amazon holds them and when a customer places an order for your product, Amazon then picks it, packs it, and then ships it to the customer and even will handle returns if there ever comes a time where a customer would have to return something. Uh, it's pretty convenient. Amazon charges a small fee to do that for you. People are always trying to figure out where to find products to sell on Amazon. So I've got five different items or five different places where you can look to find products to sell on Amazon, whether it's fulfillment by Amazon or if you did want to do merchant fulfilled as well, this could work. Right out of the gate, we're going to touch on retail arbitrage, which is basically buying clearance items at retail stores and selling them for full price on Amazon. This is where I primarily make most of my money from the hobby of fulfillment by Amazon and selling on Amazon, uh, more or less funds most of my hobbies. I basically scan clearance shelves in stores with the mobile app that Amazon provides and find items that are selling for low and then I sell them, resell them for high. On to the second place that you can look is gonna be thrift, sto thrift stores. So those are places like Goodwill, Salvation Army, Savers, whatever local thrift store you may have in your area. There's always new things uh, that might be in there that might be worth some money, as well as used items that might be worth a lot of money uh, if you know what you're looking for. The next place, so the third location is gonna be tag sales, yard sales, or estate sales. So these are just sales that people have in their yards. If you're not familiar with them, you can usually find them in your local paper. You can see where they're gonna be. You can see what people are gonna be selling. You can kind of plan your Saturday morning out get some coffee, go get a nice breakfast, and then go hit some yard sales and try and find some treasures that you can sell on Amazon. Next is gonna be Facebook Marketplace or Craigslist. So these are places online. They're kind of just like a yard sale, except customers and people are selling more specific items, but you can usually find some decent things on there that you might be able to resell for more profit. Next is gonna be for newer products. So if you're looking to private label a product or sell a different product that might be new, or make a product that you've never made before, you can find um, companies on Alibaba, which are overseas manufacturers that'll work with you, uh, that you can actually have shipped right to Amazon fulfillment centers. They handle everything. They can label all your products and then handle all the back end as well. I don't do that at all, but I know there are a lot of people that do do it and they make a lot of money doing it. So if that's something you wanna do, there is that option. And finally, a bonus is gonna be your own house. So I'm sure you have a room where you have gifts that you were given or items that you have lying around that you're never going to use again. You can try and see if you can sell those on Amazon and make a little bit of money and roll it into some of these other things, um, other, some of these other places like retail arbitrage to try and make a couple bucks. All right, well, if this video was helpful for you, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell. Let me know down in the comments section where you find things that you sell on fulfillment by Amazon and just help everybody out.